but what have we learned about sex, romance, and passion? And you'd say, well, okay, so, you know, Masters and Johnson did their research, and Kinsey did their research, all this research. There's only one thing that discriminates, well, two things that discriminate couples who have a great sex life from couples who have an awful sex life. The first is they stay friends when they have a great sex life. Love maps, fondness and admiration, and turning toward bids. That's what friendship is, okay? Second, they make sex a priority. It's not the last thing on a long to-do list. It's special. They make it important. That's the only thing that's different about couples who have a great sex life and couples who don't. 